Good morning, good morning. From Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. I'm Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group with the Morning Market Stir for Tuesday, March the 3rd. The March for March continues. New highs yesterday, 2114, up 11 in the evening S&P. The high was not a new all-time record, 2115 and a half. So still a couple of points to go to get to that 2117 level, but up uh, half a point, half a percentage point on the day anyways. The Dow did make new records, up 121, 18,248. And NASDAQ led the way, up 1%, 4,477. New highs there, 34 and a half, up 34 and a half on the session as the NASDAQ composite closed above the 5,000 level not seen since the year 2000. The dollar getting stronger, up 17, 95.48, closing in on those highs at 95.85. That's knocking the euro currency down. It was down below the 112 level at the close yesterday, 111.88, down 7. 111.02 is that extreme low from January. Bond market down two full points. Now we've shifted over. We're trading the June bond right now. 159.22 was a close in the June contract, and we're out of March. Crude oil added uh, was down 15 cents at 49.60. The high of the session was 51, the low of the session was 49, so a bit of a consolidation there, uh, even with that stronger dollar. And that stronger dollar did hurt gold. Gold was down $5, but still maintaining above the $1,200 uh, $1 an ounce level, closed at 1208. So after new records yesterday in almost everybody, just not the S&P, where did things stand on this Tuesday morning? Well, we're down three, 2111 in the E-mini S&P, down 16 in the Dow, 18,232, and off four points in the NASDAQ futures, NASDAQ 100, 44.73. The dollar's inching up, 95.55, now 30 points away from that record peak. The euro currency, 111.66, down 22. So we're about 65 points away from that extreme low. Bond market taking off another 14 ticks, 159.08. The yield on the 30 years at 2.70. The 10 year notes at 210 as it stands right now. Crude oil is gaining 90 cents, back above the 50 pivot point at 50.50 as it stands, and the gold market up a dollar at 12.09. So to wrap up the current action, with two hours to go before the cash stock market open, we're a little, seeing a little weakness in the stock indexes, down three in the S&P, down 16 in the Dow, and down four in the NASDAQ 100 futures. I will see you early Wednesday morning for your morning market stir to set up your trading day. Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group, where it all comes back to commodities.